your name and what do you do? My name is Yvonne Obiadjulu. I'm a trainee biomedical scientist. What does your job entail? A trainee biomedical scientist um, learns how to um, run and perform an, an analytic um, procedures in the lab and be able to understand test pr procedures and pathogenic mechanism in the labs and be able to interpret data on daily on day to day basis and in the end he or she should be able to um, um, carry out this test unsupervised and then become registered by the HPC to be able to qualify as a biomedical scientist. This information are um, analyzed and passed on to the senior for validation before being sent out to the requesting, clean, uh, the requesting doctors to help them evaluate and treat their patients. Do you have to study a lot? Training to be a biomedical scientist involves a lot of studying. You have to read and understand and ask a lot of questions to make sure you're on the right path. So it actually involves studying and then knowing a bit more of science, having a bit more of scientific background. Do you have to study? To, to train as a biomedical scientist, you have to have a degree acceptable by the IBMS. Um, currently, everybody has to have now a degree in biomedical sciences or a related degree or either take on some courses in the university like top-up courses to make up for where they are lacking in the necessary course. What's the pay like? The salaries are not too good at the moment. <laughs> so I just hope that the salaries will be increased sometime because it's not like what I expect. But at the moment, you can manage because you're still training and hopefully in the end, you can get more. What do you like doing in your spare time? Well, I like to watch, just watch telly, read novels and then just play. <laughs> that's all I do to relax anyway. People's interests vary, but that's all I choose to do. Have you always wanted to work in this field? Yeah, I enjoy, I enjoy science because I've never liked art, so I think I enjoy science. So I've never, I've, done, I've never had any interest in art-related courses since I was a child growing up. I've always wanted to do something in the scientific background, with a, sorry, with a scientific background. So I guess that's how I found myself in the laboratory at the moment. What would you like to do in the future? In five years time, I'll, I would have progressed from where I am now, because at the moment I'm still training. Hopefully by next year become registered if I um, finish all the work I have in my portfolio. And then from there, take up some specialist diploma courses and to be able to advance to the next band and, you know, not just remain at a, a lower level in the laboratory. What do you like most about your job? I like about my job because I'm learning a lot of new things. I am um, actually knowing a lot about diseases and um, the mechanisms. I'm also able to understand, you know, I'm also able to help like contribute in patient care by being able to run this test and um, contribute in the daily, in the day-to-day -day activities of the lab. Training in the lab is good because the all my colleagues are nice, you, there's a lot of teamwork going on there, so it's not boring actually, but it's good.